The city of Spokane is still suffering from a massive budget shortfall. And tonight, Mayor Mary Verner addressed the city on how she hopes to make ends meet. It was part of her annual Statement of Conditions and Affairs address. KXLY 4's Kylie Cruz was there and she joins us live on the Sky Deck. Kylie. Kali, tonight Mayor Mary Verner talked about the city's estimated $8 million budget shortfall for next year. And in the speech, the mayor said that the city needs to learn to accept reality and live within its means. Good evening, Council President, Council Members. She started her speech talking about the devastating fire that ripped through the milk bottle in Ferguson's Cafe a few weeks ago. So for me, this event certainly is tragic. She compared the situation to the city's own. But it's a bit of a metaphor for what has happened at the city this year. We feel the heat of the ongoing economic downturn. And we're working to keep our most critical services intact. The city is estimating an $8 million budget shortfall come 2012. That's about $1.3 million more than early estimates from the spring. No matter how we close the general fund deficit, our work requires prioritizing one service over another. We have no superfluous programs at the City of Spokane. The budget needs to be presented to City Council by October 31st, but Werner gave us a preview of what might not be on the chopping block. Maintaining safe neighborhoods and business centers is my top priority, and you will see that reflected in the budget. Despite the shortfall, Werner stayed positive while taking everyone on what she called the virtual tour during the speech talking about the new developments in the city. Marlene, our tour continues into northeast Spokane, where we've completed the North Foothills Complex Integrated Planning Study. On the tour, she also discussed the opening of Trader Joe's and the Kendall Yards development. And she ended discussing the long battle ahead. The way out of our long-term budget challenges is to grow that private sector economy. So this is our challenge. This is our charge. After the speech, we asked the mayor what cuts to the budget may include. Now, she didn't give us any specific answers, said that they will be working diligently for the next couple of weeks to finalize that budget and to get that all in order. Now, may, the mayor is expected to present the 2012 budget to City Council in two weeks. Reporting live up here on the Skydeck, I'm Kylie Cruz, KXLY4, HD News. Thanks.